Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to buy a domain with Google Domains. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is open up your web browser and search for Google Domains. Google Domains, search. The first thing you're going to want to do is actually search for your domain name. And if you guys don't know what a domain name is, for example, youtube.com, that is a domain name. Basically, whatever you have in front of .com, .net, that's what a domain name is. Okay, so here you can see domains.google, and right here there's an option to search. So just click on that, or you could just go to domains.google. I'm just gonna click on the first link. And right here, find your place online. So search for your new domain is an option here. So I'm just gonna search for a domain name that I might want. So let's just say, I'm just gonna search for Spath. Hit enter, and here we go. So here you can see all of the domain names that are currently available. Uh, spath.com is taken, spath.net, spath.org is taken. However, I can get spath.one, spath.autos, spath.us, spath.art, and all of these other domain names starting with spath. Okay, so let's say I don't want any of those. Uh, I could add on some variations of the name, so I'm just gonna add an S at the end, and again, hit search. Okay, so here I have a little bit of a better shot. Again, spaths.com is already taken. However, spaths.net is not taken. So you can see there it's going to be $12 per year. And unlike other uh, domain platforms, they're not going to change the price on you. It looks like that's going to be $12 per month indefinitely. So, you know, a dollar per month is what you're going to be paying for this particular domain name. So let's say I want spaths.net. I'm going to click on it, or if I want one of the options down here, you can see this uh, ads spaz.me to cart or whatever one that you're looking at. There's also some that cost $20 per month, or not per month, per year. Wow, 320 per year spaz.movie, interesting. Okay, so let's say I want spaz.net. I'm just gonna click on it, and right here, it just gives you a little bit of insight. Uh, this name has a popular ending, which is .net. So let's just say I want this. I'm just going to click on add to cart. Click there. Okay. And at the top right, you can see your shopping cart. So click on that if you're ready to check out. So you can see here a summary of your order. Uh, at this point, I'm just going to be purchasing spaps.net, 12 bucks per year. You could also extend it just to say like, okay, I want to keep it at this price point uh, for the next 10 years in case... Uh, the price does change because of how because of unknown reasons actually okay so right here auto renew is on so you're going to be paying whatever amount per year uh, and down here you could also sign up for a google workspace uh, and you could get like a professional custom email like right here it could be like you at spaz.net you could also just change it of business standard you can just do business starter which is only six dollars per month per user and then at the bottom, you see what is due today, uh, which is 12 bucks, and then you can hit checkout. So I already purchased a Google domain, which I will show you how to uh, edit. So I'm just gonna click at this Google domains at the top left. Okay, as you can see, I own spathy.net. Now, if I just open up another tab and type in spathy.net, it will bring you to my gaming channel which is what I had spathy.net forward to. So if you have like a blog or any uh, web page that you want your domain to forward to, uh, I'm gonna show you how to do that now. Okay, so back on Google domains, you're gonna go under along the left-hand side, you see so many options, you're gonna go under website. So click on website. Okay, from here you can see that I'm forwarding this domain name spathy.net to my gaming channel and as you can see i have the url right here to my gaming channel now let's say i don't want it to go to my gaming channel anymore or you never set this up in the first place uh, right here you see edit forwarding so click on edit forwarding and from here you can see that from spathy.net or www.spathy.net it's going to forward to this website so you could put in whatever website you want and after you added your website URL, hit forward, and there you go. It, sometimes it takes a couple hours to uh, set itself up. Sometimes it's instant. 
Uh, sometimes it could take 24 hours. So just be patient with it. Check back. So that in a nutshell is how you buy a domain name with Google domains. If this video helped you out, be sure to hit that like button. Uh, if you have any specific questions, feel free to leave it in the comment section below and I'll try and make a video about it. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later.